Joshua is taking us to a remote location here in Kentucky. Pretty cool. The trestle's up on top. I think there's a train coming. Yeah. This thing's cute. So easy. Can't see the whole thing. Sure can't. Woo. I'm not sure where the best spot is to film it. Not even sure, really, yeah. Now there is a way we could, if we were fast, we walk up to the right, we go all the way up to the top of the hill right there. Ah. Uh -huh. well, that's pretty cool, eh? Hey? There's a couple ways to get up there. I think that's about as far as we we'll to drive right there. They've got all these hiking trails around here. This isn't really a hiking trail, but it takes you to the spot where this hiking trail is in the third time. This is a shortcut. I can hear that train. There's one that came by just as I was getting in the truck. Yeah, yeah, that's the one. It might be double stacked. That's what it looks like. It's up and double Yeah, that, that train, I noticed that right when it was leaving, I saw it coming across there. It was coming this way. Yeah. The first two cars are double stack in the like. Pretty cool. All the way up here. Checking off this nice cool long trestle. And we got some track greasers right here where they grease the line. I guess I'll be able to be alright right now in Kentucky on this line where I probably shouldn't be at, but I want to get a good look at these greasers real quick. We'll sneak up here while nobody's looking. Oh yeah. Little that little tiny dab of grease right there. Greases up the uh, tracks so they don't squeak, eh? Yeah, pretty cool place. Huh. Lincoln logs. Lincoln logs, huh? Yeah. I used to play with those when I was a little kid. Yeah, somebody made their own there. <laughs> That's kind of unique, huh? I'm hearing a rumble. I hear a rumble of a train coming. Better. Here it comes. She's coming right behind you. Yeah, right there. Ah, oh, just two. There's a couple of locomotives. Just three. Pretty cool. Wait, there's more. Just two. And we got a wave, that's good. Good to have a wave. How cool is that? That's pretty cool. Just a power move. Walk down here underneath this trestle a little bit and check it out, huh? Right underneath it. Pretty cool. You can sit underneath here as the train goes over. Jawtooth is hiding over there on the other side of the track. And we got Greg right here, Meg's Railroad. And we got a train coming across the trestle. They're nice here.
can't really see the grease coming out, but it is. Wow, check out these rolls of steel. When you guys hear me talk about the coil cars, these are steel coils. Boy, is that a lot of weight there. Even got a locomotive on the back cushion. That was pretty cool. That was, that was a lot of steel. A lot of weight on that one, huh? That was pretty cool. Old Jawtooth over there got his video going. Now you guys know how Jawtooth uh, does his videos. Look at that live action, Jawtooth making a video. You know, that's kind of interesting looking at this bridge underneath. Check out the corrosion. Check out the corrosion on that bridge. Boy, it makes you wonder uh, how often they check the bridges. And Look at that, there's a whole section missing there. Wow. Just getting back into the cars and lo and behold, the train is coming over the top, so at least we'll see it from here. Give you guys an, a good idea of how high that bridge is. Check that out. One, two, three, four engines. That's going to be a super long train, hey? That's pretty cool. Alright, yeah, we're not going to catch this whole thing. It's going to be like 20 minutes long, but that's pretty neat. <laughs> 